Hi everyone, welcome to a Farlow's YouTube film. My name's JT, I'm joined here by Ben, Farlow's resident LRF expert. Something I know absolutely nothing about, but it's a, a craze that's sweeping the nation by the looks of things. So explain to me, what's it all about, Ben? I haven't got a clue. So LRF fishing is light rock fishing. Uh, started in Japan, fishing for rockfish. Um, it's been brought to the UK and adapted for the UK side of things. Um, basically using ultralight gear, a sort of seven foot rod, red, not grams to seven up to seven mainly to really light then really light yeah. okay um using sort of braids ranging sort of six to eight pounds okay so braids braids are the mono to give you that extra feel extra feel yeah, yeah. and better casting distance with the ultras perfect lures. yeah obviously the mono that would really slow things down with such a little weight yeah and and the sort of small lures and baits you're using yeah so using sort of small small sort of sand hill imitations like savage gear ones yeah, which has well, been really, really popular so yeah. far this year. And then you've got other artificial sort of worms, um, like the Mayuku Isome. Yeah. Very good bait. Um, small, like hard plastics, vibration baits. And yeah. species you're targeting? Pretty much everything? Species, or? pretty much everything. Um, people are getting species that you didn't even think you could catch with really? those. Um, you've got things like dragonets, you've got hundreds of different wrasses, pollock, bass flatfish. Fantastic, well it's a, it's a beautiful day today, we've yep. been pretty lucky because there's been a bit of a rain around, but hopefully today is going to be a good day, um, so weather's with us, so we're going to go and see if we can catch a few fish and learn a little bit more about LRF. Right, let's go Ben. It's good. First fish of the day, nice little pollock, taking on the Savage Gear sand eel. Right. So at the moment I'm using a small silver casting jig, just to get a bit of distance, see if there's any fish at range, anything like mackerel, pollock, possibly a bass, short sharp little jerks, fairly fast retrieve. Just see if there's anything out there. So what is it you enjoy so much about LRF then? Uh, it's obviously using light gear. When you get a good sized fish on it's great fun. Tackle's really light. All you need is a little backpack, a few packets of lures, small rod. Stick them in your car and away you go. Uh, if you've got a few hours after work, just pop down to your local pier. You can even use them in the fresh, fresh water for sort of perch and things. Also, it's great for kids. If you want to get your sort of child into fishing, get LRF set up. Just get them on the harbour wall, drop down the side, get little gobies, wrasse, possibly mackerel. And the kids will have so much fun doing it. We've changed rigs now over to a split shot rig. So we've got two SSG split shots up the fluorocarbon leader. With a size 12 hook and then a small piece of our Somme worm. Just going to put that on the bottom, leave the current, move the worm around, see what we get. Well, thanks very much for today, Ben. It's been really interesting. I've learned an awful lot about uh, LRF, um, been a bit of an eye opener. Obviously it's, uh, it's been his strong point. He's had plenty of different varieties today. We've got quite a few on camera. Um, so it's been a bit of a steep learning curve, but you can see it's a very effective method. Um, so if you guys want any more information, then don't hesitate to call our stores at Ben in Farlow's or any of our other shops. Um, go to farlow's.co.uk. Don't forget to subscribe to our Facebook and YouTube channels as well as you can get us on Twitter. And we'll look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks very much.